Here's how to add transitions to your videos with Flixier. Transitions are used to create a smoother change between clips or cuts. To use transitions in Flixier, go to the left tab called Transitions and browse from a library of over 55 available. To apply one, drag and drop it at the start or end of a clip. When you successfully added a transition, a blue outline will show up on the clip. To change how long a transition will last, drag from the side of the blue outline that shows that a transition is set on a clip. You can also change it in the Properties panel on the Video tab if you want to be more precise. For a nicer transition between two cuts, add the same transition to the end of the first clip and the beginning of the second one. Next, drag and drop the second clip to the left to overlap it with the first one. This will create a blend between the two clips, a simple way to create beautiful in-between transitions. Alternatively, you can just drag and drop a clip from right to left so it overlaps with the previous clip in the timeline. This will automatically add a fade transition between the two clips. At this point, you can select and drag another transition. To remove a transition, click on the clip in the timeline where the transition is placed. Next, look at the top right of the screen in the inspector, and you will find a list of transitions added to that clip. Click the trash can in front of the transition you want to remove. To swap transitions, just drag and drop a new one from the list over the already applied transition. A second method is to click on the clip in the timeline and search for a transition directly in the inspector by clicking on the transition name at the top right of the screen. Swapping a transition will retain the duration setting of the previously set one, while removing and adding a new one will reset the duration to default. You can use transitions on all object types, from videos to images and text. You can also add them on motion graphics and overlays. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tips, tricks, and video tutorials.